Hello friends, welcome to VinasKitchen.com. Uh, I am starting a series on Indo-Chinese recipes. Uh, today I will be showing you how to make chili chicken. Um, let me tell you, um, when you start to make this uh, dishes, uh, Chinese dishes that is, uh, I mean Indo-Chinese dishes, um, we need to be really quick. Um, we need to keep all the mise en place. That is, we need to chop the vegetables, we need to keep everything in place and uh, the recipe is like this quick. The mzipla need to be done um, well in advance so that uh, we are not uh, rushing uh, to find ingredients here and there. It should be right in place and then uh, the cooking is really quick. Take about 300 grams of boneless chicken. To it add about finely chopped ginger, uh, this would be about half inch of ginger. Egg white of one egg. One teaspoon of salt. Mix them all well. about 2 tablespoons of corn flour uh, that would be 1 tablespoon of corn flour and mix them well all done now let's keep this aside heat oil in a pan to deep fry once the oil is heated, add the marinated chicken pieces into it. <laughs> and deep fry them. After half a minute, turn the sides. of the oil into a tissue paper drain away the excess oil in a tissue paper and let us now keep this aside heat a wok and about one and a half tablespoon of cooking oil into it once the oil is heated add one diced onion into it Add about 2 garlic chopped, half inch of ginger chopped, and saute well on a high flame. Add half a capsicum diced. Sauce into it for the recipe. You can click on the link. Saute them well, really quick. Add two cups of water into it. If you want to have chili chicken dry, add one cup of water. Uh, if you want to have gravy, uh, you need to add two cups of water. I'm going to uh, make a ch uh, chili chicken gravy, so I'll be adding two cups of water into it. Bring it to a boil. Add half teaspoon of salt into it. Add half tablespoon of dark soy sauce. Now it has come to a boil. Let us now add the fried chicken into it. And allow 
allow it to cook for few seconds. Add 2 tablespoons of corn flour uh, mixed in water and mix well. You can see the gravy started to thicken now. Add some spring onion over it. This would be about 4 spring onion, long chopped. There you go, chili chicken is now ready to be served. Let us now switch off the flame and serve in a serving dish into a serving dish. And garnish it with some more of spring onion. There you go. Chili chicken is now ready to be served. Well friends, that was chili chicken for you. Um, please do give it a try and tell me how it came out. Uh, it is a very simple dish uh, actually and uh, well I hope you, uh, hope you will try it and you enjoyed this video as well. Uh, thanks so much for watching.